Hello, this is Daniel March, and today I'm going to be doing a review for Under the Skin. So this movie came out last year in the Toronto Film Festival, I believe, or something like that, um, or some type of film festival. So yeah, and it came out wide release this year. Um, so yeah, this movie stars Scarlett Johansson, Adam Pearson, and Jeremy McWilliams. Um, so yeah, it's got a very um, small cast. Um, so yeah. Um, for those who have yet to actually watch the movie, it is on YouTube, which is where I watched it. Um, so I'll leave a link down below for those who want to check out the movie on YouTube. It's it's about an hour and 45 minutes long, more or less. Um, definitely do check it out. Um, so yeah, 10 second spoiler warning as usual. For those who have yet to actually watch the movie and haven't already, stop the video, um, click the link down below for those who want to check it out, and... Then come back here and watch the rest of this review. 10 second spoiler warning as usual starting now. Okay, so 10 seconds are up. So for those who have yet to actually watch the movie and have it already, again, link down below and don't comment down below or be messaging me that I never gave you a fair warning. Because I did, especially, and also I'm giving you a link to the movie. So. You know, more of a reason for you guys not to message me or to comment down below for not watching the movie. So yeah, um, basically, Under the Skin. It's about Scar it's Scarlett Johansson. Um, basically, she's this alien. Um, she's ba she's basically this alien, and she's down in Scotland. Um, and she's basically seducing men and trying to. And she's she's seducing men and analyzing human life and Earth life or life on Earth as a whole. And yeah. Um, it's a very, it's a basic plot, okay, when you think, when it, it sounds like a basic plot, but it's got so many messages and metaphors throughout the movie that you just need to watch, and it's incredible just the way they do it, um, it's, this movie is a, is a movie with very little dialogue throughout the whole movie, but, uh, yeah, it's with very little dialogue, and then half dialogue, half of the dialogue is improv, and what I mean by that is because, in the movie, you have Scarlett Johansson trying to pick up men, okay? Uh, for the movie, obviously. Um, she's trying to pick up men, and th these are men right off the street. They have no idea that they're going to be in the movie. Um, so, you know, it's basically improv. And, you know, obviously these men did sign a waiver to be in the movie and whatnot. You know, afterwards they find, found out, but, yeah. But, you know, half dialogue is improv and then the other half the part that is I know scripted it's actually pretty good you know so yeah overall the script um or you know what it, you know the dialogue and the writing or whatever improv is actually very well done in my opinion the acting is uh very well done as well and also again improv the uh, thing is that the you know improv does take um great acting skills and since there is a lack of dialogue since there is very little dialogue um the facial you know you have to do you know facial expressions and stuff like that you know body movements they have to be very well done and Scarlett Johansson this is this is just a test testament as to how um great she is as an actress um so um so so yeah there are some special effects throughout the movie and those are done very well in my opinion and overall the message of the movie which is something to the effect of that physical beauty um and materialism is a huge part of our world um, which is true basically that's the message that materialistic things and and physical beauty um seem to be a huge part of our world when it really shouldn't be it should be the stuff within us you know hence the name under the skin um you know it should be our personality that should outshine our physical physical beauty or something you know, like that and that's real the main message of the whole movie and it's a very good message a great message and they do a very well done at portraying it till the end um this movie had me hooked from beginning to end it was very artistic um, very well done in my opinion and the cinematography was very well done as well um something i normally don't talk about is the the soundtrack or the other the score for the for the music or whatever um normally i don't talk about it because i really don't care to talk about it because it, it doesn't really matter for me or just I, I really just don't pay attention for it but the score for the movie is very well done in my opinion it is a huge part of the movie and it's and the score for the movie at certain parts is amazing. It's overall it's a pretty great movie from acting to the little dialogue there is. It's still pretty good. It's very artistic. Um, yeah, and it again it does have many hidden messages through it, um throughout it. 
with the main one being that materialism and physical beauty isn't as important as whatever is under the skin. And they show that in the in one of the best ways at the end of the movie. And basically, you have this hitchhiker, and he's and it's at the end of the movie. Um, he has a hitchhiker, and he's trying to rape um Scarlett Johansson, and since she's an alien, she's wearing this um suit, right, like a human body suit or whatever. Um, so. While he's trying to rape her, taking off her clothes or whatever, he rip it apart. She he accidentally rips her skin. Um, and under the skin, again the name, under the skin, there's this black stuff which is her true alien form. So right after she takes off the bodysuit, you see her true alien form. And then the thing he does is he gets a, a, some gasoline and burns her. So you know, basically it shows that whatever's under her skin, our personality really doesn't matter. Uh, because it shouldn't outshine physical beauty or something like that. That's how our world thinks. Now, I'm not saying that everybody thinks like that, but that's how they're portraying it to be, okay? Or that came out wrong, but you know, that's not how everybody thinks. But that's how most people portray beauty, you know, whatever just, it only matters what's physical or not, whatever's under us. So, yeah, they also have many other great scenes like that. And yeah, overall, it's a great movie, and on a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being the worst, 10 being the best, and 6 being decent, I give this a 9 out of 10. It's a pretty great movie. Definitely do check it out. Again, link down below. So that's basically it for this review. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I do movie reviews, TV show reviews, and comic book reviews. Comment down below on your thoughts on the movie. And yeah, like the video, share on Facebook, share on MySpace, or whatever you guys prefer. And that's basically it for now. This is Daniel Mark signing off.